Hello, this is Bug News, and today we're going to talk about Kayla uh, and her, I guess, um, emotional breakdown on Ready to Love Miami, um, where she had a girlfriend interview to two of the guys she was interested in, and um, um, it appears that uh she you know she said some tears but she was saying she was sharing some tears from past relationships and stuff um and she gave a statement on her um world f and f interview tour she did something with Kamisha reviews and she was pointing out that she um you know she pointed out you know she wasn't crying over uh, mike and the other guy i forgot his new name escapes me right now um but uh, this guy, I think he has a uh, connection with Sharice, I think too. But um, she, you know, she implies that you know she wouldn't cry over, over any man, and in in that aspect, that she really didn't know. Um, but I mean, I'm surprised that uh, that the cast are doing these interviews before the show is over. And it appears, I don't know, is that something new in the contract or whatever, but it, I mean, we know um, Kayla is a media person, and it seems like she's trying to get ahead of something, in my personal opinion, um, and the way she presented this. Um, so we'll play the clip, and you know, you, you can leave your comments at the end, and tell us, tell us what you think. Um, this is Bug News. Please like, share, and subscribe. And this was from an interview from uh, Kamisha Reviews. Uh, and thank you very much. And don't forget to hit that notification. Emotional. So I, when I saw you tear up, I watched it again this morning and I teared up. Because I was like, you know, I don't know, it touched me because I was like, okay, so she has two guys that she likes. And I guess on book, it's like she should automatically be with Randall, but she has something towards Mike. I wanted to get your opinion on that because I know all of us identify, as far as women, identify with that moment. Yeah, I mean, it really it really wasn't honestly about either one of them. It was about me. Okay. And they cut out so much that you guys don't mm. see. But um, in, in reality, me and my friends started talking about my past. We started talking about my ex. We started talking about date, like my my dating um, patterns, uh, and we just started kind of highlighting my dating patterns and how I somehow end up with men that have red flags. Clearly, when there are other men that are good options that I'm not giving a chance, so mm. that's really what it was about. It wasn't about either one of them specifically. So for any people who are out there thinking I'm crying over either one of them, again, we've only been here six six weeks. I'm not crying over no men that no. It was about me. It was about, um, you know, my life and my friend and I, you know, talking about the things that I've been through. But it's a reality show. And, you know. Yes. Oh. Yeah.